What's up guys, Hulk's Destiny here, and today we are playing Subnautica. This is a fun exploration underwater game. Completely terrifying. I am terrified of the ocean. I will not go into the depths of it. I mean, I don't mind spending a day at the beach, but once it's further than that, you can count me out. So let's get into it. We're abandoning the ship here. You guys might have seen a couple playthroughs of this. I've personally been keeping up with this game. It looks awesome. I thought right now would be a perfect time to get into it. Because of all the new updates that they have just... That is not good. Because of all the new updates they've recently implemented, it seemed like the perfect time to get in on this game. And it is still in early development. That is awesome. There's still a lot more to go for this game. First, we gotta take care of this fire, though. Before we suffocate here. Done. All right. See if we can get our PDA up and running. Greetings, survivor. Great job, not dying. Thank you. you in further survival in emergency situations. You have been issued this personal data assistant. The interface visible now will organize your inventory, display currently available construction blueprints, and holds other valuable information. So, did they know we were going to be? Yourself with it. I mean, did they know we, we would might have to make a crash landing or something and just give these out to everybody? Or nothing in our med cabinet? Or did they just figure at the last moment whoever running away could just grab one? That's what I want to know because. And. I mean, did they not just use them? until they were supposed to because I mean some people probably were just messing around with them all right let's get some food to start where are you he tried to juke me tried to break those ankles but I got you oxygen nitrogen atmosphere water and contamination high that does not seem good if I'm swimming around in here got some copper ore is this thing producing oxygen, oxygen. Producing bubbles, purple brain coral. It is producing oxygen. And I've seen a couple playthroughs of this, so I mean I know these things bladder fish can be used for water and food. Pick up some acid mushrooms, we'll be tripping soon. Swim to the surface. Probably need some more food. That does not look good. What happened to that thing? And why are these fish flying out of water? Okay. The, the, it's not just me, right? That thing just did disappear. Try and catch one of these. New creature discovered. A peeper. Alright. Let's see what else we can find. Salt deposits. Why am I just holding this thing? What's that? Trend is consistent with ongoing Creature egg. At the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. Yeah, you keep an eye on that because that's seen a dark matter drive. That seems very dangerous. Go get some air. Why am I just holding this thing and why is it looking at me? That's the real question. Pretty sure we could eat this. See some quartz there. Kinda trying to hide behind the plants. I think quartz will be useful. Alright, let's see what we can... Uh, 
All right. What can we make? Some we can make water. Might need that in a little bit. Some food. Can make a tool, an air bladder. Silicon rubber and a bladder fish. What is that? A chemical reaction produces lighter than air gas for personal buoyancy. So I'm guessing it's like a flotation device, possibly. I might make one see what it's what's up with it. Make some glass. Can make a battery. Copper R and acid mushrooms. Gonna make some food out of you so you can stop looking at me. Cook some Gary fish. Fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs. It is common for those accustomed to synthetic foods to be repulsed by the thought of eating an animal carcass. Certainly you can remember humans survived this way for many years, you can too. Now that's interesting. We're however far in the future this is where they have synthetic food. So I mean we've gotta be far enough where people have just everyone's gone vegetarian, vegan, I don't know. I don't wanna offend no one here. Um, but it's far enough in the future where synthetic food is a thing and no one eats animals anymore. Get some water. So, Alright. What we're gonna need is a repair tool. Oh, we can make a scanner. One thing about me guys that you'll find through the series is that I love information. Ooh, survival knife. I am also easily distracted. Pressure powder and magnesium. But knowledge is power, guys. The more knowledge you have, especially when you come into an unfamiliar world or an unfamiliar location, the more knowledge you have about it, scan this bladder fish, the more. What am I trying to scan? Oh, peeper. The more knowledge you have about a situation, a location, the more easier it's going to be to get out of line. Which I'm not going to do if I don't get some. There you go. If I don't get some oxygen soon. And night is falling. But the more information you have, the easier it is to survive because then you know what you're dealing with as opposed to going in blind I mean some people do they make a very good living probably out of going in blind exploring things but I mean I would prefer to have all the knowledge I can get my hands on Oxygen. to help my survival help my uh, chances of getting out alive and you can self scan now too that's something new they vital signs normal detecting trace amounts of foreign bacteria continuing to monitor foreign bacteria that's a Karar virus I don't know if I'm saying that right probably not but that's what we got to look out for on this planet And this thing also helps to destroy those rocks in one hit. Scan this scary fish. Oxygen. Why did I just scan him twice? Scan a boomerang. Probably pick one up. Oh shit, I'm blacking out. Help! Help! Get it. Woo! That was close. Okay. That was too close, guys. I'm going to need to make another oxygen tank to carry with me. Probably make a couple of those. Where's my ship? How to get so far away from it? What I also need is a knife to fight off stuff. 
I mean, I know it's not very useful against the bigger things like the Reaper Leviathan and the Dragon, Sea Dragon Leviathan. But we'll deal with those when we get there. And don't expect me to scan those either because no, thank you. All right. Cook boomerang or cured boomerang. Equipment? Yes. All right. So we're at 75 health. Save this. But that's going to be all for me, guys. If you do like the series, please let me know. Drop a comment. Leave a like. And as always, I hope to see you in the next one.